In the video, we see the Uyghur model Merdan Gabbar. He's using a cell phone to basically videotape his condition in this particular cell. You can clearly see his sad face. He's sitting on the bed and his hand is chained to the bed. Uh, obviously, he cannot move around. And this is one little cell, isolated, alone, he's inside. He's trying to tell the world what kind of condition he is in, although he commit no crime. And interestingly, this is not just any other detention facility. This is not the internment camp. This is a quarantine detention facility. Because he exhibited flu-like symptoms, he was sent to this coronavirus quarantine detention facility. The video is significant because this is probably the first video that came out of this uh, quarantine detention facility of a prominent uh, Uyghur uh, who basically had assimilate himself with China, Chinese culture, Chinese. Uh, he was uh, a model of a prominent Chinese company, Taobao, uh, to do modeling. So even a person like him is sent back to Uyghur homeland for detention. He was returned late last year for processing for the detention. He has been disappeared since spring of this year. Obviously, the Chinese government doesn't like any Thing that's happening to the Uyghur people, whether in the internment camps, whether the surveillance state, or whether the Uyghurs detained under the cover of quarantine are exposed by anybody. And in this case, clearly, the Uyghur model Merdan sent the videos of his own condition to the outside world. And uh, uh, China will definitely go after uh, people like him. The detention facilities in Uyghur regions, such as the internment camps, are still being run by the Chinese authorities, although they continue to deny the existence of these facilities and more than a million Uyghurs and others in these camps. This is still ongoing. It's not getting any better. Now, because of the coronavirus outbreak in Urumqi, the capital and other places, the situation actually for the Uyghurs is even much worse. We have actually just this week reported a new kind of detention facility, a kind of family camp, actually. The Chinese government are uh, sending released Uyghur detainees from internment camps to this family detention facilities where they allow these people to live with their families, but they still have to go through the same kind of political indoctrination, such as uh, studying China's laws, self-criticism and continue to study Chinese language instead of the Uyghur.